Mm -hmm. hey. Come on. Come on, baby. Let's get you to bed. I did. Where you been? Just walking. What's wrong? Are you awake enough? Sure. Marsha, there isn't going to be enough money to send you to Costa Rica. What happened? The department. Revoked permission on my outside job because of a conflict of interest. I could have had a full-time job with Jerry Pearl and quit the department. I tried to hang on to both jobs. I gambled. I shot crap with your future and I lost. Don't put yourself down. I'm not, it's what is. When's the last time you bought yourself a new suit? The hell does that have to do with anything? It has to do with the fact that there's no money. And you have the right to live the kind of life you want to live. You have the right to do what kind of work that's meaningful to you. I know what it's like. I know what it's like for you when the case starts to come together. You, you get quiet and I can hear you buzzing inside. It's a high. You grew up into a real perceptive young lady. That makes me happier than I can say. <laughs> but I'm disappointed in myself. <laughs> That's all. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Investigation for Angus. Victim's name was Tom Horn. According to his girlfriend's statement, he ran inside to wake up the people and never came out. Poor guy. Yeah. Heroic citizen. Tragic death. Death was an accident. The fire wasn't. Now what the arson squad said? Well, he touched the joint, all right. Easy enough to spot. Yeah. I'm at your job, huh? The place flashed on him when he was pouring the gasoline. Hey, yeah, Arson said he was sloppy, got some on his clothes, probably set off by the pilot light in the wall heater there. The name Frederick Lasko ring a bell with you? Lasko? I don't think so. Who is he? The owner of this joint. Yeah. Keep thinking I've heard that name someplace before. I'm gonna have R and I run a make on him. Well, what about this Horn's girlfriend? Maybe you ought to run a check on her. I will when I find her. She did a midnight flip. There's an APB up. Come on, let's get out of here already. Getting late. A mate come in and our John Doe from the out. No, we got the lab report. The guy had one beer a couple of hours prior. Nothing else. No barbs, no morphine, nothing. Right. Lasko. 
Frederick Lasker. Yeah. We got about a four minute wait for the backup units. What do you want to do? Nothing till they get here. Go on in and order a drink and keep an eye on them. I'll take the alley. I appreciate it if he could take a keen interest in you for about two minutes. Do you, uh, think you can handle that? Oh, yeah. I'm kind of new at this home. Is there anything you see I can, uh, do for you? Uh, thanks, but, uh, I already ordered. Listen, you can do me a favor. Don't turn your head and look right now, but you know the guy you were talking to at the end of the bar? While we're waiting. How about telling me who hired you? <laughs> you could have hell. Keeping in mind that for the next ten critical minutes, I'm your doctor. I'll give you another chance. Ah! Oh! 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 All right. All right. Maravilla, Maravilla paid me. Oh. Well, 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 it was neck and neck for the good guys took it at a photo finish. Lionel Llewellyn Blue copped out. Signed a confession. Implicated Maravilla. We can't.